Hey guys, happy Monday. I am in the car on my way back home. I just dropped London off at school. I had a physical therapy appointment today. I thought the appointment was at 8.30, but apparently the appointment was at 8. So I was in the parking lot for like 15 minutes just chilling, thinking the appointment started at 8.30. And yeah, the appointment was at 8. So when I got up there, they was like, oh, your appointment was at 8. So we have to reschedule you because she got another appointment coming. I was like, honey, go ahead. Do y'all ever have that feeling when you just don't feel like being touched or whatever? Like... Honestly, I probably have that feeling more than I should. Like, I just don't like people touching me. Yeah, I want, I'm trying to figure out who's going to do my hair. I got my natural hair out right now. So, let me see. This is like a three-day, four-day old twist out that I did on my hair. So, right now, my hair is looking like bigger than ever. I did this a couple of days ago. But you know y'all know people that really know me know that i hate wearing my real hair out i would braid this bitch up asap so yeah oh by the way i got a car um i got a car i'm not gonna talk much about it because i hate this car i do not like it let me just put that out there i do not like this car never settle okay do not settle that's all i'm gonna say on that i will show you guys the car later on when i feel like showing it off but right now fuck this car um i settled i ain't, i'm not even gonna lie it doesn't have any of the features that i wanted in a vehicle but my car note is low it's actually lower than it was for the lexus that i had got my car note is lower. I guess you could say I got a good deal. It's a 2021. Um, brand new. I drove off the lot with only seven miles on it. So I guess I should be grateful for that. But it doesn't have the features that I want. And so I feel like I settled. Why did I settle? Because I was tired of car shopping. I was very tired. And it had got to a point where... I was paying for the rental out of pocket because my insurance company, after they decided to total out the other car, they cut off the you know payments for the rental that I had. So I had got to the point where I started paying for that out of pocket. And so I felt like it was rushed. Um, and I didn't have time to really take the time off of work between doing, between my work, my nine to five, between me doing makeup and stuff and just being on conference calls and stuff throughout the week i did not have time to really dedicate to go look for a car thank you you know how you get in something and you feel like it's just not you like that's how i feel i feel like this jeep is just not me it's just not me so hopefully i'll get to like it eventually um but right now it's a no for me. And right now I'm gonna treat this car like a lease. I did. Uh-huh, I did. Thank you so much. Let me make sure she got this order right, child. All right. Here you go. I just picked up some breakfast from Panera. Do I need the bread? Hell no. I'm supposed to be on a diet, but this is gonna be comfort food.
good morning um happy tuesday so today i am going to attempt to go back to my physical therapy appointment that i missed yesterday because i was late <laughs> i really don't want to go again but i've been having some neck pain and some back pain it's probably because i missed the last couple of appointments so um yeah i'm gonna go back to this physical therapy well, i really didn't miss too many i just missed that one or whatever but i'm headed back to physical therapy today before work to see if i can get some adjustments or something made to my neck because it hurts I just left my physical therapy appointments and I feel so much better like I had so much like tense feelings like in my neck and in my back and yeah I feel like a whole lot better today I'm about to go home and start work before my lash appointment to Norwood's. But first I'm gonna get some food because I'm hungry. I've been trying to do my intimate fasting, but for some reasons, like on days that I have therapy, I am starving as soon as I get out. So I'm about to go to Starbucks and get me some breakfast really quick um, before I head to the house to start working. So, I just went into Office Depot. First of all, I called Office De Depot before I came up there because I wanted to see if they had this ink cartridge that I needed for my printer. Um, London stayed at home today to do virtual learning and she had some papers that she needed to print out for school that her teachers emailed me. And of course, I'm out of printer ink. So... I wanted to come up to Office Depot to get some ink because Walmart doesn't have the ink, Target doesn't have the ink. I called them ahead of time, right? And asked the guy, hey, do you have this ink for this Canon TS that I have? And he put me on hold maybe for like three minutes and came back and was like, no, we don't have it. And I was like, hmm. Like something told me just to go up there. Something was like, go up there anyway, because he didn't have you on hold long enough to actually go and check to see if they had it and then come back to tell me that they didn't have it. So I, something was like, just go up there and look for yourself. Child, I got up to the store. Look what I got, bam, right here. And I'm like, why? If you ain't wanna look for it, just say that. If you didn't want to look for it, just say that. But that that type of stuff really makes me mad. <laughs> for real. Because I have came all the way up here. Well, I guess I, I guess it was a good deed that I came up here because they actually had the ink at the store. Oh, that lighting is so much better now. But it's just the fact that he could have just said, bitch, come up here and look for it yourself. So now I got some ink. I'm about to go to go get some food to pick up some lunch real quick and head back to the house. But I got my ink. All right, so I just got my lunch for today. I'm on my way back home. But I had to tap back in because I forgot to show y'all my lashes. So remember I got my lashes done last night and it was a late appointment it was like around 7 30 or whatever so when she was done it was too dark for me to try to show you all the lashes but i got them on i, I did a classic look i don't like anything that's too dramatic not for like an everyday lash, ex lash extension look 
Um, I say my dramatic lashes for like my makeup tutorials and stuff like that. But I did the classic set. So once I actually stop, I'm going to show you all how it looks. But I really like them. You can see them a little bit. I'm still trying to drive too, but you can see them a little bit. Like it's very natural. Oh, I got to wash my hair like ASAP. All this is all this dried up edge controller. I'm going to have to wash that out like today. But yeah, these are my lashes. I like them. They're really, really cute. Um, just on to make, you know, put a little razzle dazzle into my little basic everyday look because I work from home so I don't get dressed up every day unless I'm actually going somewhere. When I'm making runs to the store or runs to go pick up some lunch, I'm in casual workout clothes. So, just having these little lashes done. It just do a little, you know, a little something extra. Ha, 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 ha. 